Well, I remember when the day my dad took us there, and um, Mrs. Farbstein was the uh, director. Uh -huh. We called her Mother Farbstein. Mm -hmm. And she took me into her office because I couldn't speak English. Oh, wow. I, I learned only Yiddish because my parents spoke Yiddish only in the house. And uh, she had left the door open partially, and the kids came to the door and heard me talking Yiddish and started laughing at me. And she got up and closed the door. And I learned English in a hurry. His mother Farbstein, who ran it, was very good. I got along very good with her. And uh, August 21st, when my birthday came around, she made sure I had a party. When you go to adult shelters, they're not as good as Avenues or any other place, because Avenues is the only 24-hour shelter you can stay in. You don't get kicked out in the morning and tell you to leave and then come back like 12 hours later to make sure you have a bed or not. Uh, it, it's kind of like real TV, you know what I'm saying? The real world or something like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if y'all ever watch MTV or something like that. They got a group of people who barely know each other in one environment. So really, uh, the only family I felt that I had was right in the home with the kids. Uh -huh. That was my family. But I've always wanted to have a big family where we can all get together, have this big, huge house, and all, but you know, dreams. Some dreams work for some people, but obviously not for me. It's not a place you want to stay forever. If you want to, you know, actually make it. You know, no one wants to go place to place, couch to couch, shelter to shelter. You actually want to get out, get an apartment, get a job. I guess that place is good for people who want to, like, get a fresh start. I was talking to my brother, my oldest brother, and uh, he says, well, what did you think of that, the sheltering home? I said, I liked it. In fact, I missed it. I did, I liked it. 